Very good morning, students. Last class we discussed regarding the IUPAC nomenclature of coordination compound. Means how to name. What are all the rules we are going to follow? How the book means ligand name. And for that ligand, two types: neutral ligand and second one, anionic ligand. Everything we come to know. And metal name. How the metal name will change, especially particularly in anionic complex, cationic complex. That one also we know. And certain sort of rules for homoleptic, heteroleptic, neutral complex, cationic complex, anionic complex. And how to write the name for the particular formula? If they will give the formula name. How to write the formula? Everything we discussed in the last session. Now, in this class, we are going to study about isomerism. Isomerism in coordination compound. In coordination compound. What is this isomers? Isomerism. First, before that, isomerism and the alpha are called the What do you mean by isomer? Isomers. See, any compound containing same molecular formula. Molecular formula means, for example, just just I am giving example. For example, C two H five OH. One more also C two H five O H. Just I am giving example. Just assume this is different, this is different. Just assume I am just giving example in order to understand the concept. See here this one also C two H five O H C two H five O H. They look like same. Same means same molecular formula. For example, here also two carbon atom, here also two carbon. Here five carbon atom, sorry five hydrogen, five hydrogen. One oxygen, one oxygen. Hydrogen, hydrogen. Means same molecular formula but different spatial arrangements of atom. Different spatial arrangements of atom means I can rearrange this. I will give one general example. For example, here three boxes are there. This one is blue color box. And this one is green color box, and this one is red color box. Here, how many boxes are there? Three boxes only. Now, I'm going to shuffle this. First, red, blue, green. Same boxes. What I did? I just shuffled. Next, one more way. First, green. Next, blue. Next red. All the three set of arrangements are same. No. All the three sets of arrangements are different. How the one? See, here three boxes to colors are different to them. Now I'm going to arrange my for every time I'm going to change the arrangement. Same thing, isomers means same molecular formula. Same molecular formula, but different spatial arrangements of atom. Different spatial arrangements of atom. Try to understand. Same molecular formula means same three boxes. Colors are changed by the blue, green, red. Same type, same molecular formula, but different spatial arrangements. Space means space, universe. In this space, how it looks. Correct, na? That is isomers. The phenomena, phenomena means the formation, the process. That one we call it as isomerism. 
ಐಸೋಮರ್ ಆಗೋ ಪ್ರೋಸೆಸ್ಗೆ ಐಸೋಮೆರಿಸಮ್ ಅಂತ ಕರೀತೀವಿ ಐಸೋಮರ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಮಾಲಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮುಲಾ ಬಟ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಸ್ಪೆಷಲ್ ಅರೇಂಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಟಮ್ ಐಸೋಮೆರಿಸಮ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ ಪ್ರೋಸೆಸ್ ಫಿನಾಮಿನ ವಿ ಕಾಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಐಸೋಮೆರಿಸಮ್ ಟು ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ನಾವು ಇನ್ ವಿಚ್ ಕೇಸ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟಡಿ ದಿಸ್ ಐಸೋಮೆರಿಸಮ್ ಇನ್ ಕೋಆರ್ಡಿನೇಷನ್ ಕಾಂಪೌಂಡ್ ಯು ನೋ ಹೌ ಟು ರೆಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ದ ಕೋಆರ್ಡಿನೇಷನ್ ಕಾಂಪೌಂಡ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಕೋಆರ್ಡಿನೇಷನ್ ಕಾಂಪೌಂಡ್ ಯಾವ ತರ ಐಸೋಮೆರಿಸಮ್ ನ ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ಮಾಡ್ತೀವಿ we we are going to observe two types of isomerism first one structural isomerism structural isomerism first one structural isomerism and second one stereo isomerism stereo isomerism see isomerism especially in coordination compound two types of isomerisms are possible first one structural isomerism and second one stereo isomerism especially in this structural isomerism two types we are going to observe first one geometrical isomerism geometrical isomerism and second one optical isomerism structural isomerism two types geometrical isomerism and optical isomerism optical isomerism very simple structural isomerism structural isomerism the name itself indicate what is this structure means within the complex within the coordination compound if the ligand will change their place that is structural changes that is structural isomerism in that geometrical and optical geometrical once again two types cis and trans cis and trans just observe this structural two types i'm going to i'm going to deal with very precise example see geometrical isomerism two types now geometrical isomerism see central metal atom is platinum what is this cmi central metal atom is platinum here around the platinum two types of ligands are there one is chlorine and second one amine around the platinum platinum is nothing but cmi cmi means central metal ion around platinum two types of ligands if more than one type of ligand is present means what type of complex that is that is heteroleptic complex heteroleptic complex this is heteroleptic complex one thing you just observe if all all means here two types of ligands are there what is the coordination number coordination number is 4 what do you mean by coordination number around platinum how many ligands are there four see 1 2 3 4 but all the four ligands are same no two ligands are chloride and two ligands are ammonia group it's a example for heteroleptic complex heteroleptic means more than one type of ligand geometrical isomerism we always observe in heteroleptic complex but not a homoleptic complex why see platinum cl 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 in all the cases only chlorine is there chloride is there now i am going to change this chlorine by here anything difference any difference you will observe here nothing no difference nothing why means all the chlorines are same identical i am going to shift this chloride from here to here means no difference that's 
why geometrical isomerism we always observed in heteroleptic complex. Heteroleptic complex sale absorb madu. And then see here, here NH3, NH3. Two groups are adjacent to each other. Adjacent means what? Nearby. See, two groups are adjacent to each other. Adjacent to each other. See, chlorine chlorine. Any two groups, any two groups, they are adjacent to each other. Such type of groups, such type of isomer, we call it as cis geometrical isomer. Have you seen that? Cis geometrical isomer. Cis geometrical isomer. Now, what about the trans? Cis bagi godai ko. Cis means any two group they should be adjacent to each other. Yau da tra agil. Any two groups. You are not supposed to ask. Ma, here chlorine is there, here ammonia is there. Both are different, but they are adjacent. Atra. Any two group. Just observe. All the three dimensional nodi. Yau da tra two group adjacent idi ya. If it is present, they are cis form. Suppose platinum Cl Cl NH3 NH3 Any two similar group opposite to each other. Any two similar group opposite to each other. Opposite to each other means NH3 NH3. Means different groups. C, NH3, CL, different group. They are not adjacent. See? Same group opposite to each other. What is the name of the trans? What is the name of the trans? Geometrical. Isomer. See? Here are two geometrical isomer. But this one is cis and this one is trans. Why this is cis? Two groups are adjacent to each other. Similar groups. But two similar groups are opposite. Not only ammonia. Chlorine. They are opposite to each other. Next example. One example I have. Coordination number 4. Now, coordination number 6. Coordination number 6 means around cobalt 6 ligand. It may be same ligand or it may be different ligand. But here I am going to deal with only different ligand. Why? It's a heteroleptic. So, NH3 NH3 NH3. Very simple. Here Y plus because it's a cationic complex. If you miss this, the answer is wrong. So it's a cationic complex. Then what type of uh, geometrical isomer this is? This is, see, NH3, NH3. They are adjacent to each other? Yes. NH3, NH3. Adjacent. NH3, NH3. Adjacent. CL, CL. Adjacent. Just assume here four, four ligands are NH3. Then bed are there. Then what differ are there? Third way are there? CL. Here two CLs are adjacent. Adjacent means they are very near. See, after this, this one only. Then what type of Geometrical isomer this is? This is cis. Adjacent is the name of the Cis. How to write for trans? CO6 coordination number. CL, CL. Remaining four. NH3, 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 NH3. You can ask. Ma'am, here also NH3, NH3, they are 
adjacent but here majority four ammonia no but least one is chloride 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 see both the groups are opposite if once both the groups are opposite is nothing but trans not only in this way it may like this hilly chlorine hilly chlorine bekara irbodu any group it may be they may be opposite or else they are not at all adjacent such type of isomer we call it as trans form geometrical two forms one is cis and another one is trans cis means both the group should be adjacent to each other trans means both the group should be opposite to each other and next one one more very interesting example see here i'm going to introduce an abbreviation en what is this en en means last class only i explained ethylene diamine here why should i write like this en see en is ch2 ch2 nh2 nh2 here which one is a ligating atom ligating atom means which atom contain lower pair of electron nitrogen this is one compound idu one molecule la one molecule yestu ligating atom ide two nitrogen nitrogen got it means this ligand comes under bidentate ligand monodentate bidentate polydentate ambidentate ligand i explain so many types here this ligand comes under bidentate ligand bidentate ligand andre no one ligand one molecule alli two ligating atoms ide two ligating atoms means two atoms are ready to donate the pair of electron towards metal see here idanna shall i write like this co cl cl nh2 ch2 ch2 nh2 shall i write like this en ch2 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 nh2 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 correct now here instead of this thumba confuse agadana avoid madbekanta what we did means just simply en anta represent madidivi just try to understand this en and this en are adjacent or else this cl cl are adjacent then this is cis form what about the trans form co cl cl en en this is trans form see both are opposite cl are opposite trans form it's a bidentate ligand ethylene diamine is a bidentate that's why see it donate two pair of electron towards the co only one ethylene diamine donate two pairs of electron that's why it's an example for bidentate ligand this is regarding regarding cis and trans form of geometrical isomerism see this one is there no this one is very very important for two marks in examination how they will ask the question na they will give the formula for this compound how to write this square bracket co co means central metal atom and nh3 three times n42 three times see co cobalt nh3 three times n42 three times means 
it's very simple they will give this formula and they they will ask ask you to write the isomer for this compound here one more special name we are using first one is facial isomer and second one meridinal isomer see this is facial isomer facial isomer
towards the right or towards the left. I don't know that. It depends upon the particular sample. If it rotates towards the right, if the light, if the light rotate towards the right, light always travel in straight line, Allah. Right again, bend the bending of light, you know. That is also one of the property of light. If it is bent towards right, we call it as dextro. If the same light, it pass towards, it's bent towards, or else rotate towards left, we call it as levo. Levo rotatory. Levo rotatory. Levo rotatory and dextro rotatory. See, now simple. Now I am going to take one source. From that, I pass the monochromatic light towards the sample. Once it enters the sample, it may turn towards right or it may turn towards left. Suppose if it turns the light towards its right side, we call it as dextro rotatory. Left side, we call it as levo rotatory. Very simple. After that, optical isomerism. You know, I will take one mirror. Sebo en Superimpose completely, no problem. Superimpose agilanta 
cradle frame. For example, like this. It's fully merged. But not like this. But not like this. It's not merging. Once it's not merging, we call it as mirror images are non superimposable. Mirror images are mirror images are non super imposed this non super imposed like this non super imposed mirror images i call it as enantiomers idin enanta karithini enantiomers anta karithini mirror images galu ee tara super impose aagbaru ee tara aagbeku adanna nanu enanta kariyodu non enantiomers non super imposable mirror images are called enantiomers ee enantiomers alli ಒಂದು ಒನ್ ಎನಾನ್ಶಿಯೋ ಮಾಡು ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಟರ್ನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ಅನದರ್ ಒನ್ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ಗೆ ಟರ್ನ್ ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಯಾವ್ದನ್ನ ಲೈಟ್ ನ ಕನ್ಫ್ಯೂಸ್ ಆಗ್ಬೇಡಿ ಮಿರರ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ನ ಸೂಪರ್ ಇಂಪೋಸ್ ಈ ತರ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಸೂಪರ್ ಇಂಪೋಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಕ್ಟ್ ಸೂಪರ್ ಇಂಪೋಸ್ ಆಗ್ಬಿಟ್ರೆ ಅದನ್ನ ಎನಾನ್ಶಿಯೋ ಮಾಸ್ ಅಂತ ಕರೆಯಲ್ಲ ನಾರ್ಮಲ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಮಿರರ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಎರಡು ಈ ಸೂಪರ್ ಇಂಪೋಸ್ ಆಗ್ಲಿಲ್ಲ ಈ ತರ ಆಯ್ತು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ರೆ ಅದನ್ನ ನಾವು ಎನಾನ್ಶಿಯೋಮರ್ಸ್ ಅಂತ ಕರಿತೀವಿ ಎನಾನ್ಶಿಯೋಮರ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಒಂದು ಕಂಪಲ್ಸರಿ ರೈಟ್ ಟರ್ನ್ ಆದ್ರೆ ಅನ್ನದರ್ ಒನ್ ಅದ್ರ ಅಪೋಸಿಟ್ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಟರ್ನ್ ಆಗೇ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಸಿ ಹೌ ಟು ರೈಟ್ ಅ ಮಿರರ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಅಸ್ಯೂಮ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಫ್ರಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಮಿರರ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ನಮ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಮಿರರ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಹೆಂಗ್ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಈ ಕಾಂಪೌಂಡ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ನ ಮಿರರ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಹೆಂಗ್ ಕಾಣಿಸುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಬರೆಯುತ್ತೆ ಸಿ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸಿ E N and this word E N E N C just assume here one mirror is there I just place the mirror mirror will look at the mirror here it will look at the mirror here it will look at the mirror here it will look at the mirror here that's it very simple and plus 3 charge ಡೋಂಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಮಿ ಮ್ಯಾಮ್ ಹಿಯೋ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಇದೆ ನಾವು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಬರೀಬೇಕಾ ಅಂತ ಕೇಳಬಾರ್ದು ಪ್ಲಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಚಾರ್ಜ್ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ನಿಮಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಿರ್ಬೇಕಷ್ಟೆ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಿಯೋ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ಇಸ್ ಡೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ರೋ ಡೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ರೋ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಟರ್ನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ಕಂಪಲ್ಸರಿ ಅದ್ರ ಮಿರರ್ ಇಮೇಜ್ ಯಾವ ಕಡೆ ಟರ್ನ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಸೈಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ರಿಗಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಆಪ್ಟಿಕಲ್ ಐಸೋಮೆರಿಸ್ Next example, for this optical isomerism only, see, once again I am going to place the mirror. Just try to understand, this is homoleptic complex. Homoleptic complex means all the ligands are same, same type of ligands. But this is not homoleptic complex, this is heteroleptic complex. This is heteroleptic complex. leptic complex this one is heteroleptic complex platinum is there around platinum two chloride ions and two ethylene diamides coordination number 6 i already told you especially optical isomerism is very common in coordination number 6 but not in 4 in 4 we can't observe this and see here mirror this is mirror what i am going to do this i am going to take the print print means mirror image because this one is dextro i don't know but through experiments only we come to know this one is dextro simply if i see the example i can't say this is dextro this is levo through experiment only we can we can say yes this is dextro this is levo how based on the rotation of the light towards right dextro towards left leg here see always always right opposite left mirror image always opposite to the original image that enantiomers and see cl 
CL. See, this CL, this CL as it is. This CL is there now, mirror. So, this side. Then, EN. EN means ethylene diamond. This ethylene diamond, this side. And this ethylene diamond, it will come that side. EN. So, it carry plus 2 charge. It's too simple. Now, I am going to summarize this fastly. Coordination compound, especially isomerism, two types of isomerism. First one, structural isomerism, stereo isomerism. Still now, I didn't touch the stereo isomerism because stereo isomerism, four types are there. Later, after this, I am going to explain that. So, structural isomerism, two types. First one, geometrical isomerism. Second one, optical isomerism. Geometrical isomerism, once again, two types. Cis and trans. What about the cis? Two similar group present at the, they are adjacent to each other. Trans means they are opposite to each other. And optical isomerism, optical means light, based on the light, whether they are turning towards right or left. We know the property of the light. It's always passed through straight line. Based on that, dextro and levo. Based on that, two types. Dextro and levo. This is regarding structural isomerism. Now I am going to explain stereo isomerism. Still now we discuss regarding the structural isomerism. Now, stereo isomerism. Here, four types are there. First one, linkage isomerism. The name itself indicates linkage. Linkage means, what is this linkage? See, metallic ligand link agarikala, ligating atom. Are there any difference are there? We will observe linkage isomerism. How? Especially this type of isomerism, mainly we are going to observe in ambidentic ligand. Ambidentic ligand. What is this ambidentic ligand? Ambidentic ligand means doubtful. For example, SCN. What is this SCN? Thiocyanate. This is thiocyanate. I won't say anything. See, especially in this carbon, no, it does not contain any lone pair of electron, but sulfur contain lone pair of electron and nitrogen contain lone pair of electron. Thiocyanate is a one molecule, no doubt in that. But within the same molecule, two ligating atoms are there. Means, maybe sulfur can donate or nitrogen can donate. But at particular instant, particular compound, it may be sulfur may or else nitrogen may donate. Both, they never donate. Such type of ligand we call it as ambidentent ligand. Other than we have to ambidentent ligand. And at one particular time only, sulfur or nitrogen. Here both are ready to donate. But for that instant, only one may donate. For example, two brothers are there means one small sister. Both have money. brother no But one time again, obro matra amount korta. But we don't know. Yao brother amount korta re. That is ambidentent ligand. Such type, see, in which compound ambidentent ligands are present, then aram se we can observe this linkage isolation. Just I am going to give one particular example. Cobalt and it mainly contain two types of ligand. One is NH3 five times and NO2. This is heteroleptic complex. Hetero means different types of ligands are there. No? That's why heteroleptic complex. Here just observe. Here NO2. NO2 is an NH3 is there. No? Ammonia is not ambient ligand. It's a neutral ligand. But this one is saying ambidentin ligand. Ambidentin ligand. Why we call it as ambidentin 
related ligand means here nitrogen and oxygen both contain lone pair of electron for this particular compound may be nitrogen they may donate electron or else oxygen they may donate the pair of electron towards core we don't know suppose if it is red color complex i am getting red color then it indicates oxygen donate the lone pair of electron towards cobalt means this is nitrito nitrito means which atom donate the lone pair of electron towards metal atom is oxygen this is nitrito suppose co nh3 five times no2 they will give like this only but this compound is not red color it may yellow color if it is yellow color then it's understood here nitro group especially nitrogen donate the lone pair of electron towards the central metal atom very simple linkage if oxygen is linked with co central metal atom then this one we call it as red color complex same co co nh3 fighter nh3 fighter no2 no2 cl2 cl2 same molecular formula but the linkage is different based on the linkage the color also different this is red color this is yellow color if it is yellow color it's nothing but nitro then the ligand name become nitro if it is red color then the ligand name become nitrito very simple and two interesting one linkage isomerism linkage isomerism means means which atom is going to link with the central metal atom based on that we are going to observe the isomer especially this isomerism we can observe only with the presence of ambidextrin ligand next one this is also type under this stereo isomerism second type coordination isomerism coordination isomerism what is this coordination isomerism i will write the example first after that i will explain see co here nh3 is there i am not going to write nh3 instead of that cn six time cr instead of cl i am going to write nh3 see the beauty of this compound coordination isomerism how it looks co around co six ammonia groups are surrounded nh3 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 karna this is one complex i second one cr central metal atom this one is only cobalt but this one is chromium chromium cn 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 see the beauty here see around chromium cns are surrounded with cyanido groups are surrounded around cobalt amine groups are surrounding but same and its isomer either isomer ali see cobalt around cobalt cn ammonia here also six ammonia 
but here along with cobalt, but here along with chromium. The exchange of coordinating ligands, such type of isomers, we call it as coordination isomers. Even ligands say exchange after the metal jute. Such type of ligand we call it as coordination isomers. One third one, ionization isomerism. What is this ionization isomerism? Ionize means splitting. Once if we split, we will see the difference. How? I will, I will, I'm going to split this first. See? CO NH3 5 times SO4 Br. This one is carrying positive charge, this one carrying negative charge. Correct now? This is one isomer. What about the other isomer? CO NH3 5 times Br SO4. Just see this. Here, how many COs are there? One, only one. Cobalt, cobalt. How many NH3 groups are there? Five, five. They are outside the coordination sphere, but in this, inside the coordination sphere. Here it is, SO4 inside it to first, you know, outside are there. Now I am going to split this. Here you know, the split model is CO, NH3, 5 times Br, SO4, plus, minus. But one thing you should know. Sulfate always carrying minus 2 charge. But this one is minus 2 means other match word with the plus 1 other agutta agar. This should be plus 2. How simple. Here plus 1 minus 1 charge. But here plus 2 minus 2 charge. See the difference. Here plus 2 minus 2. You just calculate the Oxidation state of metal, X, I don't know, X. This one is neutral, so 0, plus 0 into 5, 0. Br, minus 1, why? Halogen. So, overall charge, plus 2. What happened? X, minus 1 will come this side, means 2 plus 1, 3, plus 3. Oxidation state. State is plus 3 for this. You just calculate for this. X 0 into 5, 0. This one is minus 2. Overall charge plus 1. Sulfate minus 2, na? that's why minus 2. X plus 2, this, sorry, plus 1. Minus 2 goes to right hand side, means it becomes plus 2, it becomes plus 3. Means in both the case, oxidation states are plus 3 same. That's why isomerism. But only thing, when we ionize, we will get the different thing. If I ionize first compound, simple ion is bromide. If I ionize second one, the simple ion is sulfate but not bromide. But both are same compound because same molecular formula. This is, this is ionization isomerism. The name, name alla gota kudate yena gota particular. Last example, last classification, solvate isomerism. Solvate isomerism or is also call it as hydrate isomerism. What is this hydrate? Hydrate is nothing but water. Hydrate and red, it gives the clue. Water it there. Means the ligand, sorry, the compound mainly contain water. I will give this example. Especially, it looks like violet color. It looks like violet color. Just try to understand, chromium is surrounded by 6 water molecule and outside Cl3. Now, this is one isomer. What about the other isomer? 
it looks like violet color. Cr H2O five times. Five times means before six times. Now five times. One chlorine will enter inside chloride Cl. And one water will go out. Before Cl3 is there, one chloride will enter inside this Cl3 become Cl2. Water six times is there, one will go out means five times water H2. It looks like grey green. Green color comes with it. Grey green. Just see the beauty. Here six water molecules are there. Where? Within the coordination entity. The color is violet. Once this outside the coordination sphere chloride is there, no? it will come inside means in order to balance. Balance and the you six it and you six it. See, five plus one, six. In order to balance that, one water molecule will go out. Then the color become changed. Then once again, it's never end. Once again, this one more CL will come inside, one more water molecule will go out. One more CL will come inside, one more water molecule, it may go out. Then what happened? Color difference we can observe. Violet, grey, green, blue. Means, what it indicate means, isomers we can easily observe, we can easily identify through colors, through their reaction differences. Here stereoisomerism four types. Linkage, coordination, solvate. These are all example. Hydrated. See, the name itself give the clue what type of isomerism that is. Yes, this is regarding isomerism. Now, I am going to summarize the isomerism concept now. It's very simple. First one, isomerism. Isomerism means, isomer means same molecular formula but different spatial or structural arrangements of atom. Here two types, structural, stereo. Structural isomerism, once again two types, geometrical isomerism and optical isomerism. Structural isomerism, especially geometrical isomerism, once again two types, cis and trans. If the two similar group are adjacent to each other, cis, they are opposite to each other, trans. Optical means if they rotate the light towards the right, we call it as dextro and towards the left, we call it as levo. And here, one more very very important one, enantiomer. What is this enantiomer? Enantiomer is very easy. The mirror images are not superimposed. It's superimposed. If the mirror images are like this, they are called it as non-superimposed mirror images. And this one is enantiomer. And after that, you know, so many examples we discussed. Just practice once. After the stereoisomer, in that linkage, coordinate, and hydrated or else solvate. These are all examples. So many examples we discussed. Just practice once you have any doubt means just post your questions. Thank you.